In a rare on-camera interview about her allegations against Joe Biden, Tara Reid was unequivocal. The former vice president and current presidential candidate sexually assaulted her when he was senator in 1993. Accusing him of putting his hands down her skirt and violating her, Reid requested he drop out of the presidential race. I want to say you and I were there, Joe Biden. Please step forward and be held accountable. You should not be running on character for the president of the United States. You want him to withdraw? I wish he would, but he won't, but I wish he would. That's how I feel emotionally. Do you want an apology? I think it's a little late. Reid added that she is willing to recount the allegations under oath and would submit to a polygraph test only if Joe Biden also agrees to do so. The presidential candidate has publicly Trump? denied her claims. No, it is not true. I'm saying unequivocally, it never, never happened. After Thursday's interview, his campaign communications director also issued a statement, again rejecting the allegations and highlighting, quote, inconsistencies in Reid's story. The interview came as new information surfaced, however. A 1996 court document linked to divorce proceedings shows Reid told her ex-husband that she was sexually harassed while working for Biden, though it does not mention him by name, nor does it mention the more recent accusation of sexual assault. The allegations have rattled Joe Biden's campaign, which he has largely moved online in light of the coronavirus pandemic. But Reid's story is likely to be a major talking point ahead of the November election, with a growing number of Republicans seizing the occasion to accuse Democrats of only defending victims of sexual assault when they involve conservatives. Well, that brings us up to date with the world news.